Aida for purposely stopping my classmate from winning an award and subsequently making her cry? This issue is honestly making me frustrated. Almost everyone is saying I am in the wrong. People are talking behind my back and I genuinely don't know if what I did was correct or not. I just feel so lost. Please, please do help. I am 17, suffered a major accident while cycling when I was 13. I have two really deep, long facial scars. I have been bullied really bad because of it. I am tall, ugly and intimidating as per most girls. People make fun of other people by saying things like why don't you just hook up with you, throw away for 2k19. I am honestly used to it. Those people didn't matter to me anyway. But there is this girl I had known since middle school. Let's call her back I guess? Sorry, I honestly don't know how this works. I had a really, really big crush on her till a few days ago. I thought she was genuinely sweet and amazing. My family is incredibly supportive so they urged me to ask her out. I can play a guitar so I made this whole song for her. I went to the neighboring city to get her favorite chocolate and stuff like that. This was the first time I felt like really going and asking. Someone out in my life, and I felt that regardless of what I do, she shall see me for who I am and at least accept me as a friend. I was over the moon when she ended up accepting. We went to a fancy restaurant, had a fun time together and walked for 30 minutes. She was really sweet to me. The next week or so was honestly heaven. People started noticing me, even her friends seemed friendly with me, I honestly cried every day because I felt so fortunate to get so much love. It all broke down when a friend of hers, who was on Instagram and followed Beck, sent screenshots to me. I honestly felt betrayed and disgusted. She had posts saying, fulfilled his lifelong wish by being his valentines, making his day by finally helping him interact with my friends, he is ugly but beautiful people except ugly people, hashtag ugly people matter, etc. Beck's friend then explained me that she apparently wanted a good social media image and had thus asked all her friends to be kind to me and tolerate me till the first week of March, and then distance themselves from me. She apparently wanted to win some stupid, positive role model, award. For her college application because she was lagging behind in community service. And thought playing with my feelings for a few days wouldn't hurt. And apparently since I was ugly she was the kind one to give me attention anyway. I was in tears and honestly felt disgusted. My blood was boiling. I researched about this award, found a Facebook page about it online. I went to the authorities to confirm if her name was on the nominations list and then had my friends at work and family as alibi. She is apparently crying a lot because she received a message from the committee saying her nomination was withdrawn. I am now even more ostracized in school, but honestly I have no remorse whatsoever and feel far more satisfied. Edit. I am honestly really grateful for not only judging me, not in that way, but also giving me love and support. Each comment means the world to me. I am honestly crying reading some of the encouragement. No one besides my family has said these things to me. I know it might seem silly, but it genuinely means the world to me guys. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. Edit 2. Honestly the support is genuinely overwhelming. I promise. To not let you down and to continue being a good person. Thank you for the gold. Thank you all so much for the private messages you have sent me too. I honestly have gone through as many as I can and I just feel really fortunate and grateful. I sincerely hope you all have an amazing life ahead. Thank you so so much, this has been one of the highlights of my year. Edit 3. I am sorry for boring you with all these edits. I genuinely can't thank you guys enough. I showed my parents these posts and they had tears of joy too. I am so thankful to each and every one of you guys, loads of love. But, I have been noticing a worrying number of DMs saying me I could have used her body and had some fun after knowing the truth etc. I am not this kind of person and I hope nobody is. I have my own integrity. It's not right to just forcefully have sex with her, that's appalling. A couple of other DMs sent me links to secret webcams to expose her nudes etc. It's honestly horrifying. I am not that kind of person and shall never ever be one. I just want to make the world a better place and the people around me happy. I thank these people for their support, but their way to go around it is very wrong. A lot of women are amazing. My mother is amazing. The person who sent the screenshots is amazing. My co-workers are amazing. And I am sure many women out there are amazing. Please don't tell me to take the red pill or anything of that sort. Because I am not going to do that ever. Please don't say all women are manipulative etc. 
This post isn't anti-women in any way, it's me talking about the person I believe wronged me.